Wednesday morning, everyone. Yes, we made it to the middle of the week. How are you this morning? I hope everything's well in your world. And we're going to try to make it better. Why and how? Well, the weather for the most part. We are taking a live look outside. It's dark and cold out there, but not as cold as what we've been experiencing the last couple days. Good morning, everyone. We're looking at temperatures right about the 50s right now, but of course, when the sun rises, those temperatures are going to be dipping slightly. Maybe we'll see upper 40s by sunrise time, but our afternoons, the trend being is you'll grab that jacket early in the morning, and then by mid-afternoon, you're not going to need that sweater or jacket, especially for today. We are dealing with this ridge of high pressure that's going to strengthen today. As it strengthens, it's also going to be bringing about those warmer temperatures. We're actually going to be looking at numbers above our average. You can see the outline of the jet stream here, and it's keeping things well to the north and northwest. But here's some good news. Northern California at least getting some rainfall, even some snow up in Oregon. Medford getting some rain as well. But for California, Sacramento, that's also good news when we do see some of that rain. This cold front moving through, it's also possibly going to be producing some snowfall in the Sierra Nevada, which is also going to be helping our snowpack levels. And the big question is, is this part of El Nino? Well, El Nino is with us, but the effects of El Nino will not be occurring until possibly late December, January, and all the way through March. And what El Nino is, it's just like a conveyor belt of storm after storm after storm, especially when that jet stream kind of dips a little south, a little further south, and Southern California will then get some rainfall. But for right now, we're going to be dealing with temperatures in the 70s, 74 degrees in Palm Desert, La Quinta checking in at 74, 73 in Palm Springs. Yesterday saw a high of 70 degrees, and tomorrow is when our numbers will be peaking. We could be seeing numbers a little higher than today by a couple of degrees. 63 in Joshua Tree. We're going to swing it into Lumpy's Gulf weather. Tea time forecast. Here's a nice little number for you. At noon, you may want to kind of sleep in a little bit, get your Day slowly started, and then by noontime, hit the golf course. 72 degrees, wind speeds relatively on the calm side. Seven day forecast look at this 74, and then Thursday, like I said, that area of high pressure is going to continue to strengthen, giving us numbers. All that compressional heating, about 77 degrees by tomorrow, and we are looking at even 78 possible by Sunday through Tuesday. So, warmer days ahead for us here in the desert. I am El Nino. If you're going to keep talking about El Nino, I love it. That is we're actually do. Uh, the uh, SNL skit Chris Farley did years yeah, back, back from the 90s uh, when he was posing as El Nino. Yeah, you if you're an SNL fan, you know what we're talking about. Uh, the late great comedian Chris yes. Farley, the guy was hilarious. Mm -hmm. um, he was yeah, dressed he as a wrestler. A right, he was he was acting like a, a big time wrestler, but mm -hmm. he was El Nino. He was El Nino. And yeah, it's pretty funny. <laughs> anyway, Google it, YouTube it, we check out the clip. We should try to bring up that video. Maybe we'll, we'll get the clip. We'll and, get the clip. And for every you. time you mention El Nino, El Nino this winter, which will be probably yeah. daily, <clears throat> then we can have Chris come in. It will be in. daily. Chris can come in and. Yo soy El Nino, for those of you who don't habla español, <laughs> El Nino is Spanish for, for the Nino. The Nino. The Nino. <laughs> All right. Anyway, All right, we're having too much fun. Thank you. But we're the, trying to wake them yeah, up. We're going to wake them up. We're going to wake them up, up with some El Nino. But on the serious side of El Nino, when the storms do come, this is expect this kind of being the lull, the calm before the storm. Yeah, it obviously can do some damage. We can see flooding yes. and high winds, and it can get wild yes. and crazy. So, uh, but for right now, we'll joke about it until it comes. There you go. But for now, enjoy the, the warmer temperatures in December. There you go. The Nino. Twenty-two minutes past the hour. Thank you, Samad. Appreciate you, that. Uh, yesterday was World AIDS Day, and to recognize those impacted by the virus, residents in Palm Springs held a special ceremony.